ship to three gale. Oh, oh who are you? Brown hill over there. It's about 300 foot tall, so it's a stack deck. Let me get up five and a half times. That's where you would have located the music from. The people go there. Have you learned other two? There's a person behind the window. Hi, Bob. Drain back. Oh, it's a couple of hikes. Oh, we sort of found it. Like here. Oh, they're little tiny mirrors. Let's keep going. By December 21st, the eruption was over. Oh, yeah, yeah, I think. Yeah, it's not the, when the sun came, you could see the moon shape. So, this is how we have vision baggage. Do you? The forest is off the mountain, but I can't have the moon shape. The trip is kind of... This one is... Well, actually, I'm going to have to go to the bottom of the lake. Tweet it from here, you can jump in. It's so, so, easy to go down, maybe, but not that easy to go back. Relaxed. Later, have the sides. Middle's excellent. Warm, right? One out of those, yeah. Four out of five. Yeah. Oh, yeah, right in the middle. So you can see them on the sort of grip in the middle. Magma chamber in the middle of the floor. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, so no pressure release at all. So if think happens. Now we're going to see things. There's a lot of things. We're just going down the wind zone. For the reason we think that. Here, let me see the video for the mic. I want to. I want to zoom in on the ants. Sometimes you see a bit of red. After more than a year of relatively weak activity in Kilauea Crater and on the flow field, Activity in the crater increased in January 2013. Lava spilled from a lava pond that had built a small shield above the north crater rim, spreading flows down the crater side. Lava flow stopped as the vent high on the northeast flank of the crater became inactive. All that means is the lava storage tank below is getting recharged and pressurized. Such sporadic lull in Kilauea activity has led to complacency.